Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you tuning in once again. So we just come back from the Detroit uh, Area Auto Modeler Show down in uh, Warren at the Macomb Community Center. Uh, great show. That's down on 12 Mile and Hayes. Uh, good time. Great. Uh, just a great show. Uh, had lots of uh, vendors there. I mean, just tons of vendors. Uh, the place is packed with that. And it's always cool. They bring in some actual like real rides in there, some kind of custom stuff. Uh, somebody had a Dodge uh, 70s van. I'll show you in the video. That thing was awesome looking. I mean, I'm talking like, wow, just straight out of the 70s. It just, it was cool. Um, really cool. Really cool. Uh, other than that, um, like I say, had a real good time. And uh, they had, uh, AMT was there round two. Uh, they showed some of their stuff on the table, some of the future products coming out and some of their builds. Uh, pretty neat seeing some of that stuff. And when I was down at Acme shows talking to Tim from uh, Throttle Power and I said, man, you need to come to that Detroit show. And he said, yeah, I want to one day. And I walked in there and but there he is. I thought, oh, you made the drive from Kentucky. That's awesome. Uh, so it was good chit-chatting with Tim today. Um, and I was also walking around and I see another fellow and I thought, man, I saw you at the Acme show as well. And I, I go up and talk to him and, and uh, his name's Wade and we got talking and I talked to him down there as well. And he lived in Cincinnati, so him and his wife come up, so good couple. And uh, we were talking to him for a bit, and that was pretty cool. He said it was about a four-hour ride for him, and I thought, that's pretty neat you guys showed up here. So uh, other than that, meeting all my YouTube guys, all my buddies from YouTube, from Michigan here. Um, man, just so many of you guys. Just, uh, I'll put the description, uh, link in the description below for everybody's channel um, that was there. And just great talking with all you guys. Uh, just I love it. That's that is my favorite part of going to these shows is chit chat with everybody. To me, the show's not long enough because I, I spend too much time talking to everybody and I hardly got any time to go and buy anything. So other than that, Tony Lancer was with me. We walked around for a little bit and we walked by this one place and they were selling decals. Uh, these decals are made by STS, which is scale model decals. If you've used them or not, I don't know. These people are also from Kentucky and I saw the diorama, so in the video you see the, the Corvette that's in the, like the showroom diorama, like they're displaying it. Uh, this was theirs. And I, I saw that down at Acme as well, and I thought, hey, I've seen that car before, you know. And so I looked at the name on it, or the, where it was from, and I didn't realize these, this is the same people. So I thought that was very cool. Well, anyways, what caught me on my eye was the General Lee decal set. Uh, I built this car multiple times for other people. I've not built my one for myself, so it's like, I'm going to get this and get one of these and get one going. Um, and Tony was standing there and he says, hey man, they got, buy two, get one free. And I thought, really? So he was looking through and he saw this here, Fat Tony's Pizza. And I thought, that is awesome. <laughs> Anyways, so I told him, I said, well, I'll tell you what, I'll buy two of them because I thought I got some parts on tire decals. Because, uh, you know, a lot of these new kits today, they don't come with raised letters or nothing. I'm a white letter guy. I love white letters. Uh, it's old school look, but love it. Love it. Uh, so other than that, um, got me some bare metal foil. Pick some of this up. I don't know why. Um, a lot of the hobby shops around, it seems like they're always out when I go to get some. Um, wasn't a, a killer price or wasn't like free. I mean, it was just average price. They had it, so I picked it up. Uh, other than that, I got some, I uh, got these from Raisin Cane from Chris. Uh, a couple builds I'm working on here. I picked up a Pinto. Mustang 2 front end, just the kind of like the cradle. Uh, this comes with springs and everything. So check out the detail on that. I don't know if that's going to focus on it or not. So look at the spring detail. Isn't that cool? So very intricate. I thought that's perfect. Just what I was looking for. Uh, got that and also got a 2 liter Ford uh, turbocharged engine. And I thought that is really cool looking. So check that out. Really nice detail on it. And yes, this is already painted and assembled. Uh, cause I wanted to get one and he didn't have any left. So he had this on the table for display. He says, I can sell you a display or a mail you one. I thought, well, shoot, I'll take your display. I thought, heck, it's already painted and everything where he's teased me. He says, well, I'm not even charged with a paint job. I thought, perfect. I thought, saves me a little time putting it together. So that worked out really good. So that's for another future build. Other than that, I got a couple kits. Uh, I got a... Mustang Steve McQueen uh, the 80 I'm sorry the 68 bullet Mustang this was open box um, it was all sealed and everything's nicely bagged in there 
So that's pretty cool. And you guys know I like my Thunderbird Turbo Coupe. So I picked up one because every time I see one, I got to get one because these kits are getting harder and harder to come by. This box is trashed. Uh, well, that's okay. The gentleman let me look through the box and everything is sealed nicely inside. It's still in the factory plastic. Uh, somebody took, went through and went, you know, they bagged up the glass and tires and all that good stuff. So there's no burn holes through or anything. So that was really cool. Uh, so that's pretty much all I picked up today from there. So other than that, uh, like I said, I really appreciate uh, chit chat with all my YouTube guys, all my Michigan YouTubers. Uh, really good time there with everybody and uh, talking to the Hinkle family. They were there selling stuff and had a few models on the table. Uh, he had the, um, Michael had the Rat Fink van on the edge there. Um, all that good stuff. So just, it was good talking with all of you guys and I uh, appreciate everybody coming up and said hi. So I really, really enjoyed that. Uh, so other than that, uh, let's take you over to the table and uh see what we got going on uh amt round two was there um polar lights all that kind of stuff they're showing off some of their um upcoming kits that was out so i'll show you that here in the beginning and all that good stuff so all right let's go to the show and take a look hey guys welcome to the detroit show 